Hello, I am Jim Elizondo from Real World Ranching, and I have been enjoying teaching classes for a long time by now. My classes focus on both boosting profits and enhancing land value simultaneously. We call this the Total Grazing Academy, and we offer four programs, the Total Grazing Program, Adaptive Genetics and Selection Guidelines, the Optimal Cabin Season, and Nutrition When Grazing. These courses aim to maximize your stocking rate, as it is the main factor in your profits. It is not winning weights, daily gains, or anything else, but we do want those. It's just that that's not the most important. Your profits depend on how many productive animals you can maintain at a low cost per year. Now, we need to realize that having a minimum infrastructure in place makes life easier. And depending on how good your design is, your results will be. When we design a minimal and flexible fencing infrastructure, we want to consider maintenance, future needs, changing grass growth through the year and the years, changing herd or flock size, ease of moving them, and energy expended by your livestock when they are grazing. Once we have our infrastructure up and running, we can adjust. That is why I mentioned flexibility in your electric fencing design. Did you know that interacting with their livestock is an everyday training experience for them? Yes, whenever we move them to a new paddock, whenever we take them to the corral for vaccinations, to wing caps, to ear tag, whatever we do with them will affect how they see us and if they trust or mistrust us. Every day is a training opportunity and depending on you, this can be positive or negative. And this is one of the reasons that we strive for the best and minimum permanent electric fence design, a design that you can easily adjust to the varying conditions that will come in the future. Let me explain. Under the total grazing program, we grow more long-lived soil organic carbon than any other grazing system or program, period. How can I be sure we are creating more long-lived soil organic carbon? because we have measured it. 55 tons of carbon per acre in four years is a large increase in organic matter and our soil changed from white sand to dark brown sand with over five times higher productivity and without synthetic fertilizers. Okay, I am kind of sidetracked here. Back to my main subject low stress livestock management. Why did I start with a minimal and flexible permanent electric fencing infrastructure? Because it is when we start gathering our herd to take them elsewhere that low stress livestock management starts. The rest of the day will be easy or difficult depending on how you gather them and take them to the corral. So this is where everything starts. You want your cattle to pair up before herding them and you want, or driving them, and you want to take them slow. Please remember that a horse walks much faster than a cow. Take a look at my videos of herding cows on my YouTube channel under Real Well Ranching by Jim Elizondo. Or better yet, get my short infrastructure mastery training package at www.rwranching.com slash infrastructure. Where for a low cost, you will get the knowledge you need to make this happen. Did you know that anytime we stress our cattle, they lose one to five days of gain? This has been measured directly measured. You can also draw blood and measure cortisol levels after a not so good day of working your cow. 
If you have stockers and weighted them monthly, you will be very conscious of this. In cows, this will be reflected in body condition and fertility in them, oh, and also on the winning weight of calves. Okay, in this short course, Infrastructure Mastery Training Package, you will also get information about the butt box, which greatly reduces stress when working cattle in your corral. You will get info on how to train cattle to do new things for you, to maintain stress levels low in them and you. Cattle are like dogs in this respect. They respond to how you feel and how you treat them, even to your, de to your demeanor and your tone of voice. Interesting to say the least. With this infrastructure mastery short course, you will be equipped with the knowledge to train yourself to be much better at handling and every day interacting with your cattle. How would you feel having a good time every time you work your cattle into corral? It doesn't need to be stressful for you and your cattle. It can be fun and productive. Did you know that with cattle, slower is faster? Yes, cattle move much slower than us. They like you to move slow too. Once you master this moving slow and how you position, your position helps them know what you want them to do, you will enjoy having them calmly react to you. It is almost as if you were communicating with them and they are glad you know their ways. It becomes enjoyable for you and your livestock. Conclusion and recap. The number of productive livestock you can maintain at a low cost per year will determine your profits. This is very important and the main advantage of implementing the total grazing program on your land. Under the total grazing program, we create more long-lived soil organic carbon than any other grazing system or program. This means that your grass productivity per acre will be increasing in volume and in quality year over year. Your grass will start to grow faster and longer. This is why we need a flexible and minimal infrastructure. To manage a much larger number of productive livestock, it is smart to do it in a low-stress way, which ensures they are happy to see you every day and that happiness continues when you work them in the corral. We should not lose their trust in us by faulty or stressful management when in the corral. Things like castrating or such can be forgotten fast if you treat them right every day. Depending on your type of management when working your cattle, they will perform poorly if they get stressed or excellent if they are treated right. And treating them right starts with the minimal and flexible permanent electric fencing infrastructure. Every day is a training opportunity for good or for bad. And it depends on you, your attitude, your speed when moving, your state of mind, and even your smell will impact them for good or for bad. About your smell, we exude oxytocin, the calm hormone, or cortisol, the stress hormone. And just, just as dogs can detect them by smell, your cows do too. When you have a well-designed electric fencing infrastructure, one person can easily take up to 1,000 animals in a herd to the corral without stressing them. We need very low labor input if we are going to make a good profit grazing cattle. It is not only increasing grass productivity, soil health, and genetics. We still need profits every year. Well, that is all for today. Remember to get your infrastructure mastery training package where all this and more is explained in detail to get you where you want to be. 
have a pleasant time managing cattle and making a profit on your land while you regenerate it. We need more people on the land, not less. We need people who have what it takes to manage the beautiful symbiosis between cattle and grasses and soil, as they have worked together to create the best soils in the world. With different herbivore species, of course, and we now know how to mimic that process where soil was created, but with adapted cattle. Thank you for listening and see you in the Infrastructure Mastery Training Package. Have a great day and may God bless you.